fast approaching an event unprecedented in our history, a tipping point known as the technological singularity. When this happens, the world will change forever. A new chapter in human history will begin. In physics, the singularity is a point where gravity is so intense that even space and time begin to break down, like the Big Bang or the black hole. But it also refers to a time when computer power grows without limit, surpassing human intelligence, sweeping aside everything in its path. It may be 20 years away, it may be a thousand, but most experts agree the technological singularity is inevitable. The fear is, if it's uncontrolled, the results could be catastrophic. When the singularity arrives, we cannot predict what these super-intelligent machines will do. They will have their own goals and stop at nothing to fulfill them. They may even choose to eliminate everything that stands in their path, including us. My journey's over. I've heard plenty of horror stories, but you know what? I've changed my mind. I think we should embrace the singularity. You see, fundamentally, I'm an optimist. Optimists make history, not pessimists. So I'm going to come up with a solution that some people may find very surprising. I don't care how big and metal you are. Bottom line is when I melt you at 35 feet, you're not going to have a conversation with me. Ambassador Spock once said, they make excellent servants, but I have no desire to serve under them. We don't want the robots to take over the world, but they're no match for the awesome power of the force. Today, I want to address one urgent question as computer power races ahead. What happens when the machines become smarter than us? You saw what happened in the Terminator. You saw what happened in Blade Runner. What are we going to do about it? Well, I'm going to give you a radical new solution, and that is merge with them. First, this is the human brain, the most complex object in our sector of the galaxy. 100 billion neurons that can be scanned by MRI. Neuron for neuron. This means we can digitize all the information we accumulate during our lives and upload it into a giant mother computer. A vast database of all human knowledge. A resource we could share by downloading programs we want to give us instant knowledge. So when the singularity arrives, we will be in control. By merging with machines, we will enter a new age of superhuman existence. That in the post-human era, we become homo superior. We become a new species. We're talking about humanity becoming like the gods. What do you think? And how many want to sign up? It's a fantastic idea. I think what we need to do in order to get to that place is think about technology as a way of making ourselves better, as a way of coming to the fullness of human potential and doing everything we can to improve ourselves. The idea of, you know, us being able to evolve past normal human standards is brilliant. I got a whole privacy issue thing going on here, and there are some parts of my mind that I just don't think the whole humanity is really ready to hear.